Hello guys and welcome to the video. Before we continue, make sure you have subscribed to our channel and press the bell icon so you never miss any video. Kia Finch, aka Thug Misses, took aim at Tamar Braxton, who was recovering from a suicide attempt. The gag order host crossed the line when she accused the reality TV star of faking her own suicide. Tamar Braxton says she's on the path to healing after her recent hospitalisation. The Braxton Family Value star is in the process of ending her relationship with WeTV after more than a decade with the network. She's happy to be free from her contractual obligations for her reality show, but rapper Kia believes Braxton's hospitalisation is a ploy to end her relationship with WeTV. Braxton's boyfriend, David A. Faso, found her unresponsive and called for help. During the 911 call, A. Faso says Braxton became upset with her network after the trailer for her spin-off series was put out, leaving Braxton feeling blindsided. Braxton has been open about her unhappiness with We TV. She accuses the network of contributing to the demise of her famous family by documenting drama and underpaying them. Braxton recently let fans know that she is receiving treatment for her mental health. Braxton says WeTV has been exploiting her for several years. She claims that she requested to be released from her contract several times, but alleges she's been ignored. In a statement obtained by Variety, WeTV reveals they are ending their relationship with Braxton after 11 years of her being with the network, writing they will work with her representatives to honour her request and all future work for the network. TMZ reports that the show will still air. Initially, Braxton's spin-off was at due to air in July, but is now delayed to September 10th. The media outlet says WeTV will not edit any of the footage, despite Braxton's unhappiness with her portrayal. Braxton is continuing to speak out about what led her to wanting to end her life. She recently blasted reports of her boyfriend having a negative and controlling influence in her life, saying that he's been by her side throughout the ordeal. One person who does not believe Braxton's hospitalisation story is Kia. Kia claims Braxton staged the attempt to get out of the contract with WeTV. She made the claims on a recent episode of her digital show, Gag Order. Seems like playing possum might have had its benefits. People say you can fake an orgasm, but you can't fake your death to get out of no contract. People say maybe you did. WeTV released Tamar from her contract after she took Tylenol, PMs, took a nap and faked dying, she says of Braxton. Furthermore, Kia takes offence to Braxton praising her boyfriend and takes shots at Braxton's parenting. The Jasmine brand shared Kia's remarks. Big Jaw, you're being charged with giving the wrong man all the praise, playing possum to secure the bag and forgetting about Logan. Bitch, you must have had amnesia. Bitch, how are you going to forget about Logan? Because you didn't want him in the first place. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share comments and most importantly, turn your notifications on. Thanks for watching.